Um, I'm on the uh, Council on Long-Term Investing, and the issues that we've been working on is what are the requirements for uh, institutional investors to be truly long-term? Uh, and we've set, looked at two sets of issues. One is the regulatory environment that the investors operate in, and the other set of issues relates to the governance structure of these institutional investors. And what we find is that in very many cases, institutional investors have a governance system which is not really well matched with their investment strategies. So the investment strategies are long-term per se, but the governance uh, structure, the governance system of the investor is not resilient enough to, uh, to handle uh, the short-term volatility that may come from a long-term investment strategy. So a long-term investor can try to, to uh, exploit comparative advantages by accepting shorter-term volatility, but then you have to make sure that the governance system is robust enough to handle that sort of volatility. So what we're looking at is uh, what sort of metrics do we need to measure the long-term returns and what sort of requirements for a good governance system do we need to have in order to make uh, long-term investors truly long-term.